over here. Okay, so midnight's getting here about, well, she's leaving her end. I'm not sure if this means she's leaving Ponty at 2 or she's leaving Leeds at 2. But midnight should get here for about tea time. Um, I'm going to go meet her in town, then we can go get something to eat. And then we can go to the open mic. So, yay! Um, I'm guessing it should be around 5, 6 o'clock. So I guess it's time. We'll grab a bite to eat and then just chill for a bit. So, yay! Can't wait. It's going to be awesome. Um, I'm going to go for some dinner now. And just chill out till she gets here. Um, so, yeah, I don't know why I'm going to go for some dinner. I might go to a cafe down the road see what that's like. Uh, but I'll go and have a look. Okay, so I'm in town now. I'm in Wigan. Um, so this one midnight, I don't know where she is. Um, she should be getting to Manchester soon. But she's in Manchester, she'll probably let me know that she's on her way to Wigan. Okay, so midnight's on her way. I'm just up to train station now, waiting for her. I think the train should be in about six minutes. So, she'll be here any minute now. Okay, so we're at open mic. I don't know if you can see because we just turned the lights out, but midnight's here. Yeah, it is. And in a bit, we're getting up and the poems. <laughs> um, I don't think we can do the joint one we're doing because I don't want my um, tripod, but we might actually record that at some point back. Oh, never mind. Um, yeah. But we'll record each other's when we go up. If that's if you want me to. <laughs> right. I called this one. I no longer know a hawk from a handsaw. I once prided myself on my judgment. Believe the wounds in my back gave me clarity. It was fully, of course soon shattered by serpents in disguise. I can quote the greatest minds of literature, given a subject. But my own mind betrays me frequently now. Doubt in hindsight, like the sun and moon taking turns to hang at my back. I don't understand all this unnecessary emotion and folder all that apparently makes a person normal. It stands to reason, does it not, that if I had capacity to feel, then with the way my life is at the moment, I would sing with pain rather than singing with lyric. No, I'm the 1% of the 1%. Aromantic, asexual, and glad of it. Angel knows I still know the darker aspects of feeling, but the rest I find superfluous. These last years have, in their way, had me question me, loyalty, Honour, truth. I once believed that these traits made me a true second, a true friend, turned sour. But then, there's you. Quiet, patient, calm, at my flank, anchoring me as the uncertainty attempts to unsettle my already buffeted mind. If you cannot, because I can't, believe that I have empathy, you might at least believe that I know honour, honour and debt, and know that I owe you more than I will ever be able to repay, and that in owing, it does not taint or make false my oath. Age and space, red and white, emotional and emotionless, I am at your side as you are mine, long haul. Bob Amser Ak Bath. Always and forever, Heather. <laughs> there was a time an earth in seemed lost. Lost the darkness, lost the shadow. No matter what I tried, I would always lose hope. I was tired and afraid. Started to believe the demons would put me down. Started to listen to their lies. Then one day something changed. A light came on into my life, telling me I'd been lost to avoid too long. I found my smile, I found hope, I found light, and now I'm going to do all I can to keep it from going out. Find if I can wrong. <laughs> In the mirror, 
river, I see a child, broken, scared and blown. Remember my feet, remember I felt, and I say, never more. Never again will I cry and be scared. I am who I am, no longer will I be held back. The voices creep, but I rock them, fight them, with all I can. In the mirror, I see me, a girl, who sits on stage without fear, with hope and determination. Okay, so we're back from the open mic. And it was fun, it was good. Um, Midnight's just rummaging around in a bag. Um, Red and Taunton tomorrow, I mean, it's with Ian McKellen talk, and then Saturday, yeah, Saturday's Pride. So, looking forward to that. Anyway, for now, I say love you lots and lots like jelly tops, and I keep in wig and weird. Bye. <laughs>